as I landed in the hospital today. Just joking. I'm actually here picking up a family member really quick. Had minor surgery, so I'm here to get them just in the waiting room right now. But uh, yeah, I guess it was clickbait. Anyway, thanks for joining on the video. All right, guys, Friday afternoon here at the warehouse. Just getting in here. I was at two different uh, Goodwill stores locally in the area. Found a couple items, but I wanted to get back to the warehouse. Ship out some items like I have already. Those already went to the post office. I have a mess back here that needs to be sort of cleaned up a little bit. It's Friday, and I tend to clean up the office a little bit. At least get some vacuuming done and stuff like that. But um, I did have a few finds. Let's check what I got on the finds. Uh, let's see the first one. The Bugaboo Organizer goes onto your uh, cart or your um, stroller. A air filter here. Oscar the Grouch. Go away. A little plush. Best find of the morning was my Callaway Pro Caddy. And this is used to pick up your balls. If no one knows what that is. Um, pretty simple. Yeah, it's used to pick up your balls. Yes. At the end of the thing, you would pick the balls up here. Um, and then it sits in the little chute there. You can put the stand down. And then what it does is when you're ready, you hit the button thing and the ball comes rolling out. And boom, you can hit the balls. So this is a really cool find. Two different times I got this taken out of my cart. So that I leave my cart, just roam around the store and find out that people had this item in their cart. So got it back. But uh, yeah, this is a great find. And let me get this stuff listed and put onto some shelves here and inventory away. And up with you guys later. It's Friday, like I said. Probably going to grab some food in a little bit. And just enjoy the day. You guys have an awesome day yourself. Stay tuned. Sit back. Watch the video. And do me a favor if you haven't yet. Like, comment, and subscribe on the video. You guys have been doing great on the previous videos. Keep them going. I'm having fun making videos. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the content. And I want to do a Q&A at some point in time in the next couple of videos. I'm going to put a Q&A video out. So if you have any questions, do me a big favor, put them down in the comments. It could be business, it could be eBay, it could be personal, it could be the supplement company, whichever you want to know about. Ask the question, I'll answer it. You have a great one. All right, guys, good morning. Today is a town-wide garage sale for Keyport. I'm out here roaming around, checking out some great deals. You're going to see in the next couple of clips of some of the items I purchased, some of the uh, garage sales I went to that I got nothing out of as well. So stay tuned, check it out, and see what we pick up at the end of the day here. Catch you guys in a few. Some tools down here. Pretty old sewing machine. Oh wow, that's you. Alright, Look at that, Sports Illustrated. I'm back, Michael Jordan, Star Wars Insider, Guitar Hero, Jimi Hendrix, Star Wars Insider. Awesome, awesome. Let's check them out and see what they're worth. All right, so great find at that last one. The books weren't really worth anything, but I was able to grab the Swift for wet and uh, dry and wet. And I didn't notice it, but these are open. So it's probably gonna go back just to the house there. Uh, join the party, Zumba is brand new with the books, with the CD, all that stuff's in here. And yeah, so it's a great little find. All three items, five bucks. Five bucks, boom, boom, and boom, these three items here. Great find. This will probably go for about 35, 38-ish. This will probably go for about 20, 25. 
So 55, 60 bucks probably total, give or take, uh, for a five dollar purchase. Pretty awesome. On to the next one. So I pull up to the one garage sale and the guy said everything on the table is free. It's just books. Read the book, pass it along. I'm like, I do that all the time anyway. He goes, all right, he goes, how about these two bags here? He goes, you look like you need to put a puzzle together. Don't know what that means, but let's check out what he gave me. He gave me two Star Wars puzzles, both sealed bags. But uh, he's like, yeah, take them. He's like, if you can put them together, that's like, I don't know, 100 pieces. If you can put it together, then afterwards, hand it to another kid. I'm like, all right, I'll just hand it to a kid or I'll resell them. And he's like, do whatever you want with them. He's like, they're free. Anyway, so two bags, Star Wars puzzles. They're probably going for about like 10, 12 bucks a piece, but no, in, no money on inventory. So that's a cool find right there. Thanks. Shout out to the guys that gave me that. You're awesome. On to the next garage sale. All right, so that was fun. Found a couple of cool items that you saw in the last clips. Now I'm off to the gym here. Trying to get my day started and uh, errands run. So hitting the gym for about an hour and then starting my day with some errands. Catch you guys in a little bit. I'm also gonna grab a bite to eat, like always, right after the gym. All right, happy Monday, guys. I am back with a what sold over the weekend video. I was at the Goodwill stores this morning, uh, grabbed a couple of items, a lighting system, uh, like you see back here. Grab two more of these so I can set up another bigger setup somewhere else but let's get into the what sold over the weekend and these are sales that ran from Friday evening over to this morning when I walked into the warehouse I'm going to go over uh what they sold for well what I paid for it what they sold for it, and the ship cost let's get into it right now so the first one up is a PlayStation 2 Gran Turismo 3 uh video game it is brand new sealed it's got the book in there as well I paid 250 for that it sold for $37.75 with a $9 ship cost. Second up is the Tetris Dreamcast game. I paid two bucks for this one. I sold it for $50 with an $8 ship charge. Next up is the Dragon Ball Z. It does have a couple little cracks on the top there, which was noted on the eBay listing. Um, but that one sold for, well, I paid $2, sold for $33.77 with a $9 ship charge. Next up, you saw it last week when I picked them up. I grabbed the four or five of them, actually. Uh, $5 a piece. They, this one sold for $55 with a $10 ship charge. And it's got a little crease here, if you can see the creases on there. I actually messaged the uh, customer letting them know that, took photos and sent it to him. He was okay with that. So Funko Pops do go for a little bit if you get the right ones. Next up... You've seen this a bunch of times on the channel, is the Lancome uh, Perfume Spray. Again, this is a free purchase. I got probably a good 900 of them plus. Um, they were free. I bagged them up with a bag of eight per bag, and those sold for $10.77 with a $4 ship charge. Next up is a cool, let me move this over. Next up is a cool find. This is a Futurama Sound Cartoon T-shirt. This here was a purchase for $2.50. I sold it for $41.77. And this is a $7 ship charge. This is actually going to overseas, over to Norway through the global shipping program. Next up, something that no one really thinks about purchasing, but I grabbed them. Um, Airwick Nightlights. This is a discontinued item. I bought it for $1.50. I sold that for $17.77 with a $7 ship charge, and it's relatively very lightweight, so that'll go pretty cheap. Um, let's see, next up is a vintage Furby with the tag on it. This Furby does work. I tested it. I picked a bunch of these up for a dollar a piece over at a estate sale. This one sold for $52.95 with a $12 ship charge okay. uh, next up a Zumba join the party you're probably gonna see this on the same video um, I bought this over the weekend at a garage sale paid a dollar I'm sorry I paid two dollars I think for this one two dollars sold it for thirty dollars with a thirteen dollar ship charge 
brand new in the box, everything included here. Great find. Last up is our Spy Kids figurines, uh, OSS figure collection. This one I purchased for $5 and sold for $67.77 with a $10 ship charge. And that is also going out through the global shipping program. Those are the items that were purchased. Those are the items that were sold. Um, pretty good overall weekend. I've had some slower weeks in the last couple of weeks uh, leading into June, but no big deal. Pretty good finds here. Low price, high margins. So remember that when you're out, grab stuff that's got a good profit margin so you can make your income once that item sells. Anyway, I'm going to catch you guys in the next clip. I'm going to go through uh, my day here and wrap this stuff up and get back to you guys later today. You guys have a great Monday. Peace. Guys, Tuesday morning, gym is done. I'm on my grind here. I'm actually trying to lose some weight for the summer, but also for my birthday. September 15th is the goal. 20 pounds down, I'm already, well, 30 pounds down, but I'm already 10 pounds down as of this video. So 20 more pounds to go at 200. I think that'd be a great uh, goal to set and uh, weigh in to get to 200 pounds. I'm 5'8 at 200, I think that'll be pretty awesome. So that's my goal, um, that's what I'm working towards. Cutting out the carbs, cutting out a lot of the sugars, cutting, a lot, a lot, cutting out a lot of the fat fried foods uh, is the goal right now. So been doing great. Yeah, I'm at Planet Fitness. Okay, I get it, yeah, I know, yeah. Anyway, let's make it happen. You guys have a great day. Sit back, relax, enjoy the day with me. I'm about to shoot some other clips in the office and I'm heading to a pretty cool spot. Um, I got a connection over at a local area of the Bell Works, if anyone knows about that place. Owner of, the play, of one of the stores there wants some pre-workout. He's getting a sneak peek of stuff that's no longer available, um, but he loves it. So I'm gonna drop off a couple of bottles to him. Anyway, catch you guys in the next clip. All right, heading into Bell Works, right behind me there with the stuff. It's Bell Works right there. So they have storefronts downstairs, um, kind of like a community setup, storefronts downstairs. And then they have um, offices upstairs. I think it's three or four floors up, but um, offices throughout upstairs and then some stores downstairs to support the offices. Then a nice little outside deck patio area that you can hang out in do some work, get some Wi-Fi, get some power out there, throw your computer on. So cool little spot, cool little community um, set up. That's pretty much it. Don't mind the helicopter in the background. But uh, yeah, let's go in, drop this stuff off. All right, I figured I'll show you a little bit around on the inside. Uh, so right there, got the elevator going up. A little waterfall there. That's the back. Go into the stores. See them up there. Come around a little bit. So that's going to be storefronts all downstairs. Nice little hangout spot up over here. You could do your work on some of these little seats and chairs. And then all, so you got one, two, three, four, it looks like four stories on offices. And that's the whole setup. Pretty cool, pretty cool spot. So I actually had my uh, supplements over at one of the stores in here. Um, they weren't really moving, so we pulled them out of the store. Nothing crazy, but the owner actually loves the products. So uh, bringing them a couple of bottles here, like pretty cool. So I told him I would supply them with them even though we're not in the store anymore, which is nice. And uh, thank you, if you're watching the video, for your support. Anyway guys, this is a cool little setup here. I think I've done a photo shoot in here as well with some of the supplements. So um, I do like this spot. You can walk around, it's kind of like a track setup here. Walk the track, kind of on the outside. And then you can hang up here as well, on the inside. All those little tables and chairs. Get some coffee, podcast studio going on over there. So, cool vibes, cool vibes. 
and I got some WeWork I think stations in here where you can rent a little office or or a, a table set up for the day or the month or whatever. And then the Bell Market. Go here, grab some lunch, and that patio setup is outside over there. Maybe I'll take you guys through in a little bit. But let me drop this stuff off. See you guys back in a little bit. All right, so I'm actually in the store here. I'm gonna give a shout out to two friends of mine. Uh, they both have their clothing line in this location here. Um, so Kim, if you're watching, shout out to Roman Body. Kim, she has a fitness brand, shorts, tank tops, and also for Lamara Sportswear. Laura, how are you? Amanda, I'm shouting you guys out. So check out the video. Also another sports line. So all of her stuff here. She's got bra tank tops, she's got leggings, sports bras, a whole bunch of stuff here. So Lamara Sportswear, Laura, and Kim, shout out to you guys. You guys are killing it. All right, and this is the outside patio area. We're setting up for a private event here today, so it's a little crazy, but it's kind of hang chill. There's some couches, there's tables here. There's uh, normally like an outside bar that you can grab stuff in as well over there in the left corner, but this is it. Nice little setup. Hanging out down here on some tables and chairs in the shade a little bit. And then bam. Alright guys, let's get some work done. Going back to the office. Heading back to the office and I will see you guys in a little bit. because that's all I got we didn't ship out much and I'm I'm fine with that I'm actually really tired today so taking it easy I have a gym event later on tonight I'm gonna head home grab some food so I'm hungry after the gym I really didn't eat anything but uh yeah should be fun tonight at the gym we're gonna be in LA Fitness in Union it's been a while since I've been there but um Got some new items coming onto the table as well for this evening. So I'll probably record that really quick clip. Last night was crazy over at the gym in LA Fitness in, where was I? LA Fitness in Lodi. But sorry about the noise and construction and craziness out here. But there's a lot of construction going on in the neighborhood. I wanted to film for you guys. But yeah, that's it. We're at the post office, as you can see. And I'm gonna take it easy for the rest of the day, grab a bite to eat when I get home, and maybe even an hour nap before the gym event. So stick around, stay tuned to the next clip. I'll be at the gym later on tonight. I'm gonna record really quickly before it gets crazy and chaotic over there. Do me a big favor, like, comment, and subscribe. It only takes a second, hoping that you guys love the content. But uh, I'm out. I'll see you guys later on tonight. Stay tuned for the next clip. I'll be at the gym giving out some samples, selling some products, and just having some fun. See you later. All right, hanging out over at the LA Fitness in Union. You can see my table back over there. The place is crazy. A couple items that have been selling uh, shorts, BCAs have been blowing out. You can see the tub's probably a little empty over there at the bottom, but that's my setup there. I'm gonna finish out the night, hang out for about another hour or so and call it a night here. And normally get here around 4.30 to five, hang out till about seven o'clock. So be my night in about a half hour, maybe an hour max. And I'm gonna end the clip here. Guys, thank you for your support. Thank you for viewing the videos. Comment, like, subscribe on any of the videos here. As always, you can check us out, trinitynutritionlab.com. I also shouted out Kim for Roman Body and Laura for Lomero Sportswear. I'm gonna link their uh, websites down below in the description box if you ever wanna check out their items. Feel free, you're more than welcome to. Don't forget to always support your boy as well. Boom. And you guys have a great night.
Stay tuned to the next video. And again, thank you for watching. Have a good one, guys. Peace.